Hello, welcome back boys and girls. Thank you for joining us again today. Now we have a fabulous book for you. Today's story is called Girls Can Be Engineers, written by Jamelia H. Lindell, illustrated by Beatrice Mello. Now this wonderful book is about a sweet little girl who discovered what she wanted to be. Now let's see what happens. Let's get started. Career day at school was only a few days away. Anna was excited but nervous. Now she had no idea what career to choose. How would I know? Which one is right for me? There are so many careers to choose from, she said. Should I be a veterinarian? Maybe a pilot? Yes, that's it. Now Anna recalled how much she loved taking a plane when going on vacation. How cool would it be <laughs> to fly a plane across the ocean? <laughs> so that afternoon in class, Anna turned to Ryan and asked, Did you choose a career yet? Well, I'm going to present on being a police officer, just like my dad. How about you? asked Ryan. And Anna told him proudly, I'm going to be a pilot. Oh. Now Ryan, looking confused, said, You can be a pilot, that's for boys. Says who? Anna asked. <laughs> I see male pilots all the time at the airport. I have never ever seen a female pilot before, answered Ryan. So Anna thought to herself, have I ever seen a female pilot? Maybe Ryan is right. I guess I'll choose something else. She said, sadly. <laughs> now later at home, Anna asks herself, What else could I be? And her eyes met with a poster of the pyramids in Egypt. That's it! I could be an archaeologist! I could travel all over the world to dig for clues about how people lived in the past. How fun would it be to learn about mummies and explore the pyramids? <laughs> and the next day at school, Anna sat with a friend Olivia, did you choose a career yet? asked Olivia. I'm going to be an archaeologist, just like the ones in ancient Egypt, said Anna. Now Olivia looked puzzled and said, I think only men can be archaeologists. When we watched the video on artifacts, the archaeologists we saw were male. Have you ever seen a female archaeologist? Now frustrated, Anna thought to herself, why does it matter? Whether you're a boy or girl, shouldn't you be able to do anything you want 
because you love it? <laughs> now, later that day, Anna decided to turn to her mom for help. What are you working on, mom? Asked Anna. <laughs> I'm designing a bridge for work. Would you like to see it? Well, our job is to ensure that the bridge will be safe and strong enough to carry cars and trucks. Wow! I want to be an engineer too. Can girls and boys be engineers? Asks Anna. Well, anyone can be an engineer. Your gender does not matter. Wow! Why do you ask? Asks Anna's mom. Well, for career day, I wanted to be a pilot. But Ryan said only men can be pilots. And then I decided to be an archaeologist. But then Olivia said only men could be archaeologists. <laughs> said Anna. I see, said Anna's mom. Well, although it might seem that some careers are for men only, in reality, anyone can do them. And we can all do anything we put our minds to. Now, Anna thought to herself, I want to be an engineer. And so the next day, Anna wore a pink hard hat and boots for a presentation. <coughs> I want to be a structural engineer just like my mom. She began. Well, structural engineers design and build structures like bridges to solve problems. And there are different types of engineers, such as civil and electrical. And when I was choosing a career, I thought that some careers are for men only, but this is not true. Girls can be engineers, and we can be pilots or archaeologists. We can be anything. The end. What a wonderful, wonderful, beautiful story. Thanks for joining us for another fabulous story time. Thanks for being here. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll see you soon.